Good morning, children. As we have completed our syllabus of social science, so the chapter of civics first, the topic is the Indian Constitution. I have taken it for the revision. So I think that you will get acquainted with some religion part. Let's see that. The Indian Constitution, we all know that it is constitution. Earlier we have seen some Nagan said we shall make this. Like I am starting here, the book says football, hockey or cricket, the names of the games. You all know that where you play football, hockey or cricket, there are some rules. Why? If no rules in the games, what is the meaning of that? So everyone who is playing the game has to abide with these rules and regulations. So necessary a result with a rules is justified the better game the game. As we have seen that the football match if you touch the ball with your hand, it is found that you are given the penalty, the mistake, charge, that means you are losing there. Similarly, other games, such rules are prevent. In the games, what are the rules and regulations for it better mean? Similarly, we see that the rules of games, rules, near. Like the game's rules or what we follow the rules in the game, a society has constituted rules. Must we are living where? In a country, in a society. That means we are following certain rules. We have no right to break it. That make it different from others. Like means civilized or uncivilized. We all know that we are human beings, but we have freedom not to disturb others. Where is the rules must be followed by everyone in the society. And for this reason, we give the value of rules and regulation in our society also. It says here, a written documents, similar kinds, where what rules are written documents in which rules are mentioned is called constitution. So, as we all know that our country, which was ruled by the British before 1947, we have not our own constitution, constitution of England. Similarly, the rules which we follow nowadays, it is mentioned in Indian constitutions. So it says that the most, and today most countries of the world have a constitution. Why all democratic countries are likely to have a constitution? It is not necessary that all countries that have constitution are democratic. So it depends over the form of the constitution. Democratic or non-democratic. Democratic or non-democratic. Constitution serves on several purposes. Yeah.
first, it lays our certain ideas. Certain ideas that form the basis of Says here that we as citizens aspire to live first. That is a constitution, some of several purposes. First, it lays our certain ideas. Hamare Misha, Hamare Adras. वो संविधान में वर्णित होता है जिससे हमें ये कहने का कि बेहतर हमारा हमारा देश है हमारा समाज है ये पहला है इसी में कहता है ए कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन टेल अस व्हाट द फंडामेंटल नेचर ऑफ आवर कंट्री और आवर सोसाइटी समाज कैसा है डेमोक्रेटिक लेवल से या नॉन डेमोक्रेटिक लेवल अ कंट्री इज यूजुअली मेड ऑफ डिफरेंट कम्युनिटीज Share certain beliefs. A country, whether India, any country, India, Pakistan, Bangladesh, where it is a country where people of different communities live, and constitution provides equal rights to all, and people enjoy them. It is a democratic country that is. The constitution helps us. What helps us? As a set of rules and principles that all persons in the country agree upon as the basis of the way in which they want the country to be governed. It means a country like India, when the constitution was trying to make that time, the people who were in this assembly they had a arduous task. Wasan ka main tha, India. Which has a large society, large religious people, large different communities, and one constitution required. कैसे उन्हें बनाया? ये हम सबके लिए एक वरदान है. A person who made it were great persons. कहता है, like that in the game of football, in which a change in the constitutive constitutive rules will change the game altogether. अगर किसी तरह का चेंज अगर गेम में रूल से करते हैं तो पूरे सिस्टम को ही बदल देता है सिमिलरली है ना इट इज सेज दैट द सेकेंड इंपॉर्टेंट पर्पस ऑफ दूसरा जो है कहता है द सेकेंड इंपॉर्टेंट पर्पस ऑफ कॉन्सेस टू डिफाइन द नेचर ऑफ कंट्री पोलिटिकल Nature of a country is political system. So we see that ये बताता है कि किसी देश में political system कैसा हो, like in our country, the village level, the district level, the state level, the country level, we all are. The places we are different governments for form their world for the better of same city. So we see that. But I, in democracy, fourth point. We choose our leaders so that they can exercise power responsibly.
responsibility on our behalf. by others on the name of religion and the caste. 
जाति और धर्म के आधार पर कोई हमें अलग नहीं कर सकता सिक्स है ना सिक्स क्या क्या है इट इंस्योर्स वाट इंस्योर्स दैट अ डोमिनेट टू मैग्नेटी डोमिनेट ग्रूप मतलब अ मैग्नेटी दैट डोमिनेट ग्रूप डज नॉट यूज वाट इट्स पावर अगेंस्ट
going through considerable turmoil. बहुत बदलाव हो रहा है संविधान बनाने के क्रम में उसी बात क्या हुआ पातिशा इंडिया पाकिस्तान इट इज सेंड दैट सम ऑफ द प्रिंसिपल स्टेट These are the main key features of the Indian Constitution. The first is federalism, parliamentary form of government, separation of power, and fundamental rights. In charge, key features for Ambedkar next class. Today.